We're currently in what feels like the middle of nowhere. It is the middle of nowhere. At a FedEx. <laughs> to pick up our kit in person. Oh, um, don't forget the customs clearance with the Canadian government. Yeah, so we had to get the slip, get it stamped to see what is in the package first of all and then right here and then we're waiting in front of a big door. It's the real deal. To get it loaded, I am so excited. I'm so excited you're gonna get all the behind the scenes. out of four bags and I am hoping that the fourth one is gonna arrive before we leave and it is now Monday and we leave on Thursday so it is scheduled to get here for Wednesday but I'm gonna start looking through everything that I have so far this is so freaking exciting like I have waited a lifetime for this let's go I have this one I think this is like a small suitcase and this big bag full of clothes. So I'm like a little apprehensive of everything fitting. That's usually something I have a problem with and there's no time to alter it. But you know, we're just gonna roll with it. Let's see. You're supposed to stay away from the color red for the next seven days. Why? It's from the show Evil. You're red for filth, too. I know. Red or be dead. This like is a lot of I know, I feel like there's nothing in this, though. This is like but one I of those can... like, hockey suitcases. Hockey duffel bags. I know. But I can absolutely use this for my skates at the competition. Oh, nice. It's cool. <laughs> Why are you reading a popsicle right now? Because while opening bags that I need you to snack. <laughs> like I need the sugar. This is cool. I'm loving a mix. You're like a little kid. It's literally like Christmas though. A bass for something and you wake up not knowing if you're gonna get it, then you go downstairs and it's all there. Except you're missing three bags. I'm missing one bag, um, which is another clothes bag. Which is kind of a problem. But this is really cool. They sent a lot of stuff. And this is the company Wait, that they I'm... sent you skates. Or is that shoes or it's boots? Shoes. But this is the company I'm in the advert for. Oh wow. I know. Some snow boots. They're actually nice. Wow. Mm -hmm. I feel that. Are they your size? Uh, I hope so. They know your sizes? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like them. They're really cute. Cause it's baby blue. Powder blue. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to get a chair. I'm gonna be here for the next two hours. Okay. At the rate that you're going. Well, this is how I open Christmas presents too. I inspect everything. They're just like white and Sun protection. 
So are you taking these bags with you? All of them? Yeah, and then you're my gonna other pack, suitcase. Like, your, you're going to pack your luggage in this? No, my other suitcase to clean your baby. Is it tight? No, it's my good size. I love the color though. Like this would be the perfect color of the backpack. <laughs> I guess so. Nice baby blue. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get to the I like red. Red is a statement. I said, boy, I should just start taking it all out. Of it. I'm gonna I wonder like who takes care of organizing all of this. And it's like a full, it's a full process. It gives a multiple people that have to coordinate with Adidas and get all of this done for you. Cause this is all custom, right? Yeah, but it's all like in all the sizing and stuff. It's like they just grab and put it in the bags and then the bags go. But normally they have like a full on cutting out day and we get to go through the whole process. So cool, you can be able to have this forever. Ooh. They sent you two. And why not? <laughs> There's a many days to get through. And this looks like it's in blue as well. Oh my god. <laughs> yep. Same thing in blue. I love the color of blue this year. Like they really went with like a turquoise. Or turquoise. I don't think that's turquoise. You don't? No. What would you call it? Blue. Is this pajamas? It's either pajamas or like long johns, thermals. I don't know. <laughs> I love this. I love the shade of red. No, it's like a kind of ready orange. Mm -hmm. It's way more like. Yeah, it's more orange, right? Yeah. I like it. Yeah, it's all for winter? Yeah. Oh my god, this color! Oh, baby! This color is fire. You like it? Oh my god, when I have the tan for the event, this is literally gonna. This is it. This Why is, is chicken still frozen? it. Like solid? Close. More thermal. Oh my god, these are like, I don't know if this is the opening thing or, um... How will you know though? Like, are they gonna tell you? I feel like we, yeah, there must be like a piece of paper or something. Get there or something? But look, it's like, um, golf pants. <laughs> You're never gonna wear that. <laughs> never. Unless it's for the... Oh, you know, maybe it's for like the closing or part of like a suit. I don't know. I never know. I never know. And we'll actually, well, maybe when we go tea off with your dad. Yeah. Which we'll be doing when we go in March, right? I won't be golfing. Why not? I'm gonna go without you. Yeah. And embarrass myself. Yeah. Okay, why? I'm like, these t-shirts have a big ass neck. 
I like want to try it on, but I also don't want to take this off. Why? Because <laughs> I like it a lot. It looks like a really like white, white neck. It's a lot, right? <laughs> Well, I have one in white and two in navy so far, so I'm not sure if I have an option. No, that's just a, an, an open neck. That's a, there is a, such a thing like that. The style. It's, it's like a loose neck. I mean, I love the sides. Like, this is really sick. And like, the back. Yeah, but you don't like loose fit, so you're not gonna wear this. I don't, and it's I don't- It's too loose for you. You're gonna wear this for pajamas. I feel like I'm showing a little much. No. What's a little much? What are you trying A little to? much shoulder. <laughs> a little much tattoo. <laughs> anyway, this is absolutely wedding so far. I, I, I freaking love it. Okay, next. Nice blue t-shirt. Ooh. Here again with the baby blue. Blue shirt. And my favorite, my new favorite color. This will be the competition jacket. When you go to competition? When I um... When you're competing? Yeah. <laughs> tight. That's really tight. No? I mean, I think it's supposed to. Okay. <laughs> oh. It's a little gilet. Or maybe I'm just gonna feel like I could wear this on day one because it's so cold here. Okay. What is this? Oof, this is so nice. Yeah, that is, that is really classy. I cannot with you. Yeah, it's really nice. Very British. It's very like regal, no? This is what we have to travel in. What, you said travel in, in a specific outfit too? Yeah. So they basically planned all of your outfits then. Yeah, they, plan they have literally planned all our looks. So you don't have to bring anything, except for underwear and socks. Yeah, now and they don't in. and they don't want you to because they don't want you to wear anything that's not. So they brought you, they gave you underwear and socks. No, I mean clothes. Yeah. So now I, mean, I understand why they brought, they gave you so much. This is basically your luggage right here. Yeah, it's it's everything. Okay, this is really soft. That looks so nice and comfy. Is it like a fluffy material? On the inside? Not really. No, outside. No, it's just like... Thingy, but it's so clean. But it's like, um... Again, this is a good color on me. How many times have you said that? I've said it about two things. This color and this color. Yeah. You don't normally like blue or red, though. I, well, I know, but like, and also like, I like this too, but then I'd be saying about too many things. A little long. <laughs> the old shorts. This is what I wanted to. From things that I've seen, these look cool. 
These are good. Well, I mean. Just lower the waistband. I will never be allowed to wear these on the ice due to the color, but this is the good fit for the ice. Wow. Like, I honestly, considering I'm missing a bag, I like honestly don't know what I could be missing. I mean, maybe I should like look at all this. I wasn't expecting that when I wasn't looking. That's so cool. I love the jacket. I love jackets. I'm not a fan of clothing, but jackets are always nice, you know? This one's well done. You'll be wearing this for a long time. It is insanely heavy. Yeah. This is for the opening ceremony. Yes. It has to be. <gasps> it's my favorite jumper. So during like the announcement day, we had to wear this specific jumper to do a video and I, I fell in love, so where are you going to put that on? I love it! Pride, respect, responsibility, unity, and it's like the Team GB pillars. I just love it. It's really nice. But I saw you wear this already, no? Yeah, I wore it for the announcement day. But it's so nice. Ooh. Okay, this is gonna match much better. Size. Okay, this is also a nice touch. Like on the inside like this. Oh, they fit so well. Oh, I love that they're short. <laughs> I feel like um the guy from the Peaky Blinders, you know? Yeah. What was his name? They all wore pants like that though. I know. Oh. This is warped. Ski pants? Skiing? Skiing. <laughs> How it's supposed to be. So you put it over your boots. Over my what? Your boots. My boots. My my boots. I think this is going to be my favorite jacket. Good inside color choice. This one you don't like. Similar yeah. to the other one you have. Huh? Similar to the other one you have, no? Well, it's like a recurring design, you know? Yeah. Oh. This is the one. This is my kind of jacket though. Oh my god, look. B R. I can't find the G though.
Did I not have like a, a winter jacket on earlier? Cause this is like an actual ski jacket. Mm -hmm. And this is what? A third one. What? Another one? Oh no. For the curling team. That is everything that I have for just now. Um, and I feel like I'm still missing like opening, closing ceremonies, boots for that, and just a whole other bag <laughs> in general. But I'm gonna give you a little sort of um, view of what is happening. Yikes. These are my favorites. This like kind of quilted jacket with the detail. And then this red under kind of heat tech top is so nice. I love the color, I just love them. So I'm now in the Olympic Village in Beijing, which is freaking exciting. And unfortunately our missing bags did not arrive in time before we left. But thank you to Team GB for fixing us up when we got here with are missing bags and I'm just so grateful for that and I'm so grateful to get to wear this amazing kit every day. It's so nice, you can't really see it. Um, yeah, I just, I appreciate it so much. And yeah, excuse my physio bed forehead. <laughs> um, but yeah. Please do all of the liking, the subscribing, all of that sort of thing, and I will try to make more videos and post some stuff. Bye.